those are some similarities here. Let's talk about some differences. Um, this I already said, so defense mechanisms are conceptually rooted in psychoanalytic theory, whereas cognitive distortions, I have not mentioned this, they are rooted in cognitive therapy. So, and now cognitive behavioral therapy is sort of the, the, the mo most well-known iteration of that now. That matters if you want to get way down in the weeds of, of how these are different. That really matters in terms of the theories that they are built on. They are quite different theories, but I find them both useful. Difference in function. So defense mechanisms primarily, and I want to emphasize the word primarily, protect the sense of self from anxiety and threat. So it's about my sense of self. I can't tolerate what this situation, this choice, this reality would mean about me. Therefore, this defense mechanism is used to protect me, my sense of self versus the cognitive distortions, which are systematic biases in thinking. Also protective and protective of me, right? But this really is about my process of thinking, not my way of being in this moment. So a defense mechanism is more something I am doing or a way I am being to be protective. Whereas a, a cognitive distortion is a way I am thinking. It's a way I'm processing the data and thinking. Defense mechanisms can actually be adaptive in some circumstances. They're not all bad. And there are times when we need them. They are survival for us in some circumstances. And as we'll see when we get to them, there are even some that are truly adaptive where it is a good defense mechanism. Whereas cognitive distortions are typically always maladaptive. In other words, even though they're protective, they don't actually serve us for good in the long haul. Defense mechanisms are much more difficult to bring into our awareness, whereas cognitive distortions are more readily conscious with training. If you can come to understand them, you can catch them easier. So defense mechanisms, a way of being with, with an action um, tied to that, usually yes, versus cognitive distortion, a way of thinking, a pattern of thinking, more systemic 